Coming up this week on LMTV at Excelsior. A basketball star is coming back to Lidmar. We wrap up with the amazing race. And in our Blue Zone update, something that does a body good. LMTV at Excelsior is next. This is LMTV, Linmar Television. Excelsior, your news starts now. Welcome to LMTV at Excelsior. I'm Peter. And I'm Kyle. Time now for today's top story. He was named Mr. Basketball when he played at Linmar. Now Marcus Page is coming back to help raise money for charity. LMTV's Kale tells us more about his visit. Kale? Marcus Page was an outstanding basketball player for Linmar, and now he's playing for the North Carolina Tar Heels. And he's coming back to Linmar for a charity basketball game. He'll join other star college players as they face Metro Area High School seniors. It should be a great game. It's Saturday, April 16th at 7.30 p.m. in the high school gym. Advanced tickets are $10 and are now on sale at the Excelsior office. Cash only. A portion of the proceeds will go to the Ronald McDonald House and here to Linmar. Check out the posters throughout the school to find out more. Back to you. Thanks, Kale. Here's Katie and Kale with your PBIS Point of Information Minute. What do responsibility, respect, and integrity look like in the hallways specifically related to food and beverages? This is a great question, because there have been many students bringing food and drink into the hallways and locker areas. Drinks other than water and water bottles are not allowed in the hallways or locker areas. Keep all food and drinks in the cafeteria. Responsibility is shown by following the rules of no drinks other than water. This means no coffee, no pop, no Gatorade. This means nothing but water. Now they have Now it means nothing in Spanish. No drinks other than water. Got it? And food other than candy from the student store is not to be brought into the building unless in your lunchbox. Leave no trace. Make sure all candy wrappers are picked up off the hallway floor, and this means candy from the student store. Respect is shown by following these rules and not talking back to the adults when you are asked to take your food or drink back to the cafeteria and eat or drink it before moving back into the hallways. It is important that students understand that no food and drink rule is to help us keep our buildings safe and clean from critters. Critters, like mice and ants, are attracted to sticky food and drinks. Thanks for your attention to this week's PBIS Point of Information Minute. Thanks, guys. The race is over. LMTV's Batty has the numbers. The last leg of the amazing race has come to an end. The sixth graders made it a clean three-city sweep this year by winning the race to Santa Clara from New York. The final totals, eighth grade came in last with 1,300 miles. Seventh grade was second with 1,410 miles. Drum roll, please. And the big winner, 6th grade with 2,520 miles. Yay! Congratulations to everyone and keep up the positive work here at Excelsior. Back to you. <laughs> Thanks, Maddie. Are you feeling stressed, overwhelmed, or worried? Time now for today's Beat Anxiety Tip of the Week. Here's Maddie. If you're feeling stressed, first thing to do is remove yourself from the situation. Relax, take a breath, and count to ten so you don't feel overwhelmed. If that doesn't work, take five deep abdominal breaths. It may seem silly, but it really does work. Dairy foods contain a wealth of nutrients. Besides calcium, they also give you vitamins A and D, protein, potassium, and magnesium. Try low-fat milk or yogurt. You'll love it. I'm Katie with this week's Blue Zone Update. I'm Josh, and here's what the lunch crew is cooking up here at Excelsior. Monday, it's barbecue rib patty sandwich. Tuesday, it's waffle. Crispitos are featured on Wednesday. Thursday, it's chicken teriyaki and brown rice. And there's no school on Friday, so have a nice long weekend. That's lunch this week here at Excelsior. That's a wrap for this week's edition of LMTV at Excelsior. On behalf of the entire cast and crew, thanks for watching. Have a great week.